So today we want to talk about our internet-based scrolling matrix display. It uses the I.O. bridge to talk to XP device and ultimately to our display. At the top of this image you can see our I.O. bridge module. This allows us to connect to embedded devices through the Ethernet. Specifically we have tied to this a serial smart module that allows us to send serial messages to our wireless XP breakout board. The XP device allows us to send wireless messages over the 2.4 gigahertz frequency range. Top of this image, you can see an 8x8 blue LED matrix. It has 64 LEDs and is a, comes as a module with 16 pins. At the far left of this image, you can see our LED matrix controller. This is an XP device with a microchip microprocessor on board to process serial messages and drive the MAX7219 LED matrix displays that we have off to the right of this image. You can see where the LED matrix fits into the through hole pins over the driver board. This makes for a great device since uh, everything's modular and we can connect up to 16 of these matrix displays together at once. In our case we have eight of these all set up for our display. Now comes the fun part. You can see the matrix display is currently displaying the link to our website. Go ahead and check it out if you want to see some of the cool stuff we work on. In the meantime we're going to give you a little bit better breakdown of the components that we're using. Specifically here you can see the XP device, okay? the PIC microprocessor that controls everything. And if you wanted to, we have a real-time clock and everything. But that's not going to be implemented from this. It's also driven by a USB drive, so it's 5 volts driving this whole thing. Pretty cool. To aid us uh, additionally, here's a breakdown of the MAX7219 driver board. So there's the chip itself, and then it has some pins going in and pins going out. These basically act as big shift registers allowing us to talk to a whole bunch of these devices at a time. You can have up to 16 of them as we previously mentioned and in this case we have 8. The LED matrix itself is just a, it's just a circuit board that's mounted with LEDs in the front. You can see those. And then you basically can tie these and put those through the modular connectors. And then by connecting the two boards as such you can connect a whole bunch of them all together. Pretty simple really. So now here comes the cool part. We're going to take our iPhone here Using the IO Bridge widget, uh, we have a display basically where we can uh, show the messages that we want. In this case, we're going to send the message IO Bridge. It's currently going to connect over uh, the 3G network, and it's going to update the display. And there you go. It's that simple to update your matrix display using the IO Bridge and XB wireless uh, connectors.